friends. YouTube friends. All right, today I'm gonna make, I'm making rundown, coconut rundown with salt fish. With cassava dumpling and dashin and the whole works and cassava. All right, we have some coconut over here, so we may have prepare. So I go on, cause me not want great tight, but it will take a long time for greater. So me not have the, the, the time feed right there now. So me go cut it up. See me in the process of cutting it up right there now. And then um, my wife over on the other side over here, so I prep some some herbs, some scallion, some um, pimento. Bell pepper, tomato, bay leaf, thyme, and um, we call this not Jamaica susumba, but them call it here eggplant. eggplant. Oh, so, susumba we call it not Jamaica, and them call it, it's an island, them call it eggplant. And see, yeah. and see the saltfish over here, sir? These are the saltfish we're going to use and do the rundown, you know? So right you now I prep the stuff them. So sooner or later, they'll sit me up back when I finish cut up the coconut and blend it up and juice it up and all of them things there. So a mad thing. So tune in back to Byron Island vibes, you see? All of the goodness in the coconut, but the salt fish, I'm gonna make sure I deal with that. And um, the susumba over there, so with them call um, eggplant. eggplant. You know, we island people, we eat a lot of stuff, but we flip it and call it different name. Yeah. We eat the same thing, you know, bro. Mm -hmm. 
But when flip it and call it different name because right now when I want um, island food. In a Asian shop, I go get island food, I get dashini in it. I get cassava in it. Yeah, they call it yam. Yeah, they call it, they call it yam. You know what I'm saying? But we eat the same food. So when, when Jamaican come here and say they can't find the food, like the just touch a Asian place and you find everything. Yeah. Everything get planned, hook rock. The world works. So me just go get some saltfish down there, so codfish. As they call it, saltfish, codfish. But that it me go use because they have mackerel in them, but it's fresh. I have to go get it and can it. For all one, three, four days or weeks. You know, to get a nice mackerel taste outside. So, stay tuned. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. So, my wife will clean up the place and all these things. I'm going to line up the pot for the coconut milk. Line up the pot for the dumpling and the dashing and the yam over there. So, I'm going to make sure everything will go on. Because I want to make half a video because what? A, a long time, me no eat this. Yeah. From me left Jamaica all long, me no eat nothing like this. And to them like, me just lay down on me and say, boo, you know, say, me need more some running and say she will cook it, but she say, she have a little headache and me say, all right, we have come do it, it and do the thing. Me have some avocado over there, so I'm mad thing to you know, because when me finish with it, but here with the next thing now, me no like my run down when it just white. Me like put a little either curry or Curry keen at it, make it have that nice cook color with the salt fish and all that good thing. You see what I mean? Say? So just straight tune back and link me back on the journey. YouTube, that one you go sell off. Like, share, and subscribe to that video because that one you mad. I have enough things in there. I don't do no jerk chicken. I don't do no oxtail. I don't do no curry goat. All of them things I don't do in here, you know. All right. Stay tuned because a lot of people are saying, Baron, you're not going, but I'm not that man. My family left on diet. So them I lose weight the 14 days. Them video that I do them in the 14 days and them eat up a whole bite. Right? So now they left on diet. I can't do no more video. No one of them eat it. So comment and tell me. Just comment and tell me if anyone I want to want to come cross and come eat some of that food there. Yeah. Because I'm willing to cook the food them I want to come feed you know, but not come for too much. You hear what I say? Bless up yeah. and big up yourself. Stay tuned. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. I'm coming back when I may line up the pot with the flour. <laughs> line up the pot with the rundown. Mm. Boil the salt fish. Go for the gully bean over there, sir. Sure. Mad thing, you know. Sure. You hear them call it? Susumba or gully bean. Mad yeah. thing. See you back in a few. Man, man, man. A salt fish, see there? I want to cook baby one and give it. Mm -hmm. the, the, the Korean they call it bakala. Bakala. They call salt fish bakala. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, trust me, guys. Right, mommy. They call salt fish bakala. Ask Miss Vivian McLean what they call it up here. Bacala. Saw fish name Bacala. When I hear the name, I was like, what the heck? Bacala. What is Bacala? Ask uh, for so codfish or salt fish, they said. What? Bacala? What? <laughs> I have it here. I was like, damn, man. This thing have a whole bunch of names. Codfish, salt fish, Bacala. Codfish, salt fish, Bacala. I wish part of the fish they caught them ask the fish if it was your bacala. I wish part of the fish named Bacala. When they catch a fish from the sea, 
The fish they mean name call and say them all and call and say bacala. <laughs> I don't know it as bacala oh boy. This is salt fish. It's sweeter than meat. Fun is a family thing right here, so. Cause a long time them not eat run down. You see what I say? Family thing, yell up to my family in Jamaica. Big up Mark, big up Omar and Charmian, Chancellor Abigail. Shout out to you guys. Vivian, what was up? Who again me no yell out? All of my people in Jamaica. I love you now, you see? Big up Wow, Wow Chef from Rima. A real man. You see it? And the rest of the team. Make the dream work. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, this is the cassava. Come back. call it Tom. What do you call it again? When you call it different from cassava, I don't really know about the cassava. This. I got this. I call this. I got add this. I got a piece of this. Because I don't want the whole of this. I cut half of it. Come on. Piece of this in the flour, cassava flour. Mad thing, you know. Cassava flour never a long time I don't eat them something there, you know. From my left St. Mary, you know. I don't eat them something there and see it here. Today it just come to me and I just say I'm going to do a video. Cassava dumpling. Salt fish run down. The whole works. I have all yam. But wait to the part there. Soon. Check me out back, man. A mad thing on go on. Mm -hmm. I'm going to peel it right now. I don't want to peel it on the camera. I'm going to peel it through now. Alright. See there? I'm going to take. See there? A lot of people know that you deal with it. So. See how I go on? You know that this me used to. My father used to plant it around the back of the yard and I used to go dig it out. <laughs> dig it out and boil it. And eat it with butter. Bad. Give me a smaller knife. You know? And a big knife that will kill me. See it? Look. See it, friend? This is how we do it. Crack it here, sir. See? And we peel it off. We peel it off. From my wife, I don't know a little bit of food, you know. Mm -hmm. Nobody watching big pot over this, you know. I'm going to put it over there, but use them big pot that you don't want something boil over. You don't want the, the, the water boil over upon the stove. You see me, I say, YouTube friend. You see what I go on? What I go on? I'm not thinking, I just feel like I have fun today. Because every time I do my video, I'm like, I'm sad. And the COVID, I'm sad, you know. Because I just lock up in the house and I come like, I lost my mojo. Is that me and say? Alright. See it here? See the cassava here? Alright, I'm going to rest this over here so my wife will take care of that. And then I'm going to get here so salt out back. I'm going to wash it off. Crack this off. And I'm going to split it down the line. See it here? So I'm going to split it here. Give me one of pan over there so baby. Baby. See there? Alright. So I'm going to grate over here sir. So. I'm going to use this because this is not what it's great. So it's not really great off me now. See it? I don't think that's how it's in here too you know. If you don't get certain things out of them you know. You see this? It's a sweet cassava. I don't think this will do anything. It's a sweet cassava. Grit on the other piece. I line up everything in you know, my friend. 
everything may I put together, you know. So I'm going to put clips here, so clips here, so till when the boat I sail go to Kingston, out of Germany. So I'm going to look a little bit this, a little bit this, a little bit this. I think this is all what I want. This is all what I want. Thank you. See? Me no want it just full of beer. A ton of the cassava peanut. This is just what I want. This is enough. You know, make a twist. Friends, the cassava thing this you know. The cassava thing. Don't watch a cup you know, it's all a red cup. My thing. So this are the cassava dumpling now. Flour me and eat up. See? everything out you know make sure everything in at the door yeah you know I mean? see that cassava cassava dumpling all right cassava dumpling So I go on. Now back down the the salt fish or the cod fish boil, then throw, throw off the water and then put some different water because I don't want it to be salt. You know? Now then then settle for the pressure to ground zero. Alright. A little dust of flour. I'm not spoil, but I like when it have that smooth when I'm done, you know? So I just have the thing set. I have the, um, the turn on this one, you know? So I have the coconut just gonna boil down to a boil. I'm just gonna add a few little things to it. A few little things, because you know, me love the herbs I mean, I'm a thing. So I'm going to put it back over that side. And you know the worst thing about it, when I need my flour, and you put it down, you know, let it sit. Because you will over, you know, you suck out all of the, you know, all of that and get dry and hard. So, boo, and a little bit of the olive oil over here, sir. I'm going to damp a little bit of olive oil till when I'm ready to put that in the pot. So, a little olive oil, keep it moist and all that stuff. See? When I make it, when I make the dumpling, them, I think I don't put too much, but I flour this, you know, and it, you know, it does, it does suck out everything back. Observe all of that oil. So I'm going to wrap it up. I think we put too much, but look alright. It's not a bad, it's not spoil. Um, Boo, put some plastic over this now, please. Let's cut the plastic and wrap it down low. Oh, wrap the floor itself? Yeah, wrap up the floor itself. Wrap the door itself. Alright. 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 Alright
right? Then, dry me on. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, go over this one now. And then we are rough on this side, you know, like crazy. We have the, the, what got next? Eggplant. They call it eggplant. The susumba them. I'm going to boil them, you know. Because they eat them raw, you know. They eat them like salad, you know. But I like so, never eat it like that before. I'm going to boil it in my um, salt fish. Just a couple of minutes and then take them out, them, set them on the side. And all that good stuff. And you know, over here, so now, this is my yam. This is my yam. I don't know what type of yam it is, but when I peel it, it's white. So it's African. This is the African yam right here. You see, I'm going from Africa. So I'm going to peel it. Peel some of it, not all of this. And when I peel it, I show you guys how it look like. And this is um dashin. Them call it another name, but me don't know. Yeah, dash. Them, call, uh, them call it yam, but me don't know everything they call yam. So a dashin, me know it as. All right, so I'm going to peel with the big knife because I'm them big, so I can't peel with the big knife. We can't go with the big knife, you know? So I'm going to peel this. The water around this, sir. Already. So I'm going to peel and wash. I'm not making a lot. But if you're making run down, probably you can go for a second, you know, if the food nice. And my son, them said they never eat this before. So probably the bigger one like dumplings still in them. Love him dumpling, but then you give him all six in that mash up that. Love him flour, man. But the small one, I think he teeth them a rubber. I put the yam like this. I don't know. I don't know people if maybe make it stay like this or give them a little cut in the middle. Make them look more to the plate. You know? Yeah. Yeah. I think I like this more. That I think this yam is pretty good. Because I don't want to do so much yam. And the next thing I'm going to show you guys. When you have yam and you don't want it to turn black, tip a little oil on top of here. Or you can peel it and put some oil, put it in the freezer. Beautiful. I went to Texas and I have some when I came back, it was so beautiful. That's what I'm, um, uh, you know. So this is that um, piece I'm gonna let um, sit aside. Right now I'm twanging, but I don't want to twang, I want to go back to the roots. Because right now, tonight, a yes or nice. See me, I ring some off over here, sir. A yes or nice. I know the worst thing. I don't cook with a lot of salt. The salt fish already have been salt, so I'm going to put no salt in the, in the, the, the other pot over here, sir, because the salt fish is there. Right now, it have a boil over here and I'm gonna flip this salt fish sooner or later throw up this water get some other water and put it to boil again you get a lot of the oh then this one start boil over this already so so I'm gonna add in and this is coconut milk right here I'm gonna start boil it so it come like the food pot I go finish, leave the, the rundown pot, but I saw it go. So I just want to work with this on this side. You know, make it things go happening. So my wife will go help me with the salt fish pot. Mm -hmm. Drain off the water. The thing underneath the beer. Pasta. All right. Yeah, two of them. Oh. Two of them. Oh, you have a bullet again? Yes. 
boil it again we get out much salt and then we're gonna right? put the yeah put some at the boil with that water friend they're not really make dumping really nice and sexy you know we're gonna make dumping really nice and sexy so this are my dumpling them when we make my dumpling them see it press them like this we come to this side so this is how them look like so I'm going okay, to close the coconut pot, so coconut milk pot because we don't want it to boil over. So just I'll leave it back, it going to sit and boil. I'm not really want to stretch out the video like that. I'm just to make sure I get everything on point. Bit some pieces. When it starts, I hope it finish. This is my dumplings that I'm making right now. A few minutes later. We we'll come back to Byron Island vibes. Saltfish rundown, you see? Yeah. You remember some of the show and men I put in the the cassava dumpling them. See them that do them thing? Alright. Half master pot, the saltfish still up boil a little bit. I have um slash slash gully bean slash garden egg slash susumba. I'm going to add it in the saltfish pot but get a little boil and make sure you know, wash the thing them really good because them so somebody I come in, at the age and store my bite you know so you know, wash the thing good make sure you know, wash them really 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 super good alright alright so I add them to the saltfish pot but then go and you know boil and make sure you know, pick up that little this little black piece this little piece right here. Alright. Alright. So now, my coconut milk is boiling. You know? But here we know is my, my thing, you know. When I boil, when I do my rundown, you know, because I used to see the the of them do it back in at the time when I used to watch them. Them used to have a little piece of garlic in them rundown. Meanwhile, the coconut is boiled down. Right? I go had just two couple berries of pimento seed in it make it go on boil I have thyme I have thyme I have rosemary I just want it boil in it alright I have some slash of ginger right here sir I put in it for the time being nothing much I put in it just something for just keep on you know, boil with it, make you have that flavor in the ear. I go on. I may have my rest of stuff them over here, so I add in me. Me, me, um, my skeleton, my tomato, my lemongrass, as we them used to call back in the days, fever grass. I may have some pepper over there, so I have bell pepper. I have more ginger. I may have some, some dry seasoning. I may have some mixed herbs over here, so I have my garlic, I'm a bay leaf, I'm a pimento seed. Well, me just like, give this some more time for boil down and see you guys back in a few when me put all when me add back them stuff the inner the coconut milk all of these herbs and the salt fish me go clean it all up pick it down take out the bones them out of it take out the slash gully bean susumba garden egg put them on the side make them cool because they go add in this you know and at the run down it all go with the salt fish and all of them something there you know I'm going to tip a little bit of um, turmeric because I like the color of my one change a little bit. I don't like when it does white. I don't want to run them, but I don't like when it's too white. I love curry, you know. I'm um, half Indian, so I love curry. And the dumping my boy. See you back in a few, alright? Alright, welcome back, my YouTube friend. So, this is how the run down look like. This is what I'm telling about. A mad thing. But you're with me, you know. I like when it have a little flavor in it. So I'm going to add in some stuff in it, you know. I'm going to have my salt fish over here. So when I already deep one, I'm going to break it to put in it. I'm going to break it because I'm going to save it. I'm showing you guys. I'm going to deep one it and I'm going to break it up to put in the thing. So I have some skeleton. I'm going to add it. 
make it cook out. May have some pepper here, so but yeah, me not use all of that. I'm gonna finish add my um my pimento seed and my bay leaf in it. I add some tomato, I'm gonna add some of it, not all of it. I have some bell pepper, I'm gonna add some of it. Some green one, I'm gonna use the whole of it. So you have one, then I have the salt fish over here, so now I'm gonna break it up. Because I already debone it. So I have tear it apart, I'm washing all these good stuff, so you know, I break it. Because Back in the days when I eat saltfish, I like when my saltfish is up on my plate. I don't like when, it, you, 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 when you look, you see all of these running things where the, where the, where the saltfish is gone. It's gone back in the ocean. You know? So, I eat this so the boat is going to land. And I go had in all that. You know, land it, you know? Land me, the boat, it has a duck up. It has a duck up. Not land, to adapt. See me put in the salt fish. Alright. See me fish them in there already. Alright. I'm going to add my gully bean them in there. I'm going to add my susumba slash gully bean egg, egg, egg plant. See it? Alright. That's how rich it is, guy. I have all the pot with me. Because I saw it things take more time. You know. I leave the toilet over there. So, alright, friend. You know, so it rich. Look, see it? You see what I want? Alright, I move, remove some of them, um, them, them time here. And so forth. Alright, see me have one piece of bone there right here. So. And, friend, guess and tell me that piece of bone there. You see me save right there. So. I threw my debone it. My wife not really like me whoop me take what chew with the bone. She and you will go far for bone. She will cuss you. So me have to add back the, the piece of bone, one bone here night. Because she love bone. Remember me tell you now, she love her bone. Alright? So you see? This I'm a run down. See it? This I'm a run down, friend. See that? Look how I run down nice and pretty. It's a happen. It's a It's a With Germany. And right now, it come like me there. It come like me there, Jamaica. Yeah. Me there, right now, me there, right at St. Mary and at Tobie, where I'm from. See? And my wife come from Rima. So I them place her with her right now. Alright, you all go on. I have some dry herbs. I got a little bit of dry herbs. Alright. Black pepper. You know you can't leave that. Because you have to put a little S in a black pepper on the thing. Alright. So. This I'm a run down. And. I'm going to plate it. I'm going to plate. A plate. And show your back. How it look. When I plate it. Because the. Land, I remember, so we dumpling them over there, so all right, kind of look like it looks messy, but in a messy, so I it's here that is Jamaican food. You know, Jamaican food look all here, look nice and big and bulky and tastes good. I will put a lot of love in it. That are the rundown, people don't can't believe it how nice it is. Look how beautiful it is. It has sizzle to the nizzle, mad thing. It has gone. I see you back in a few when I plate it. Alright? Love you guys. Subscribe. A few minutes later. Right, friend, this is the finish, finish dish. I send up the likes and pan it. Likes, share and subscribe. Tell a friend. And a friend tell a friend. Mm -hmm. This is Jamaican rundown. When I do straight from Germany. Mm -hmm. Share and like. Because some of the time we can't even get them things and a salt fish do it. You see how pretty it is? Jamaican run down. Mad thing. With salt fish, with cassava, dumpling. Have a something. What a something here with the cassava, dumpling here. It's mad. Share and like and subscribe, my friend. I may have a whole more video. A whole more. To come. To come. So this.
it's only just begun. Hey. All right, friend, you see me as a share, like, and subscribe. Peace. Love on you guys.